Hi, in this video you will learn how to apply eyeliner for the top and bottom waterline. And I'm also going to show you simple tricks as you're keeping your waterline dry so that you can apply the pencil liner and also how you can make it long lasting. So let's have a look at the tools that you will need. And now that you know what you will need, let's get started with the first step. Now to make sure that the eyeliner will go on smoothly, it's important that you're going to use a few Q-tips to dry your waterline. This way there's no water on your waterline and you're going to apply the eyeliner pencil later on on top very easily and it will make it long lasting. Now when it comes to choosing the eyeliner pencil, you can have any color for it, but if you want to create a dramatic eye makeup look and also that will frame and close your eyes a bit more because you might have bigger eyes, then you can also go in with a black eyeliner pencil. If you want to open up your eyes, then you can go in with either a white or nude one. And this way you can also apply it smoothly on your waterline. What's really important is that the tip of the eyeliner pencil is not too sharp so that it will feel comfortable while applying it. And if you're going to tear up while applying it, which is completely normal, then take a Q-tip and put it towards the inner corner so that you can catch up the tears and won't mess up with your look. Now it's time for eyeshadow to set the eyeliner pencil. In this case I'm going in with black eyeshadow as well as using a flat eyeshadow brush and pressing it on top of the eyeliner pencil. So it's like if you would apply a bit of a base and then use powder to make it stay put. And this is what we are going to do with the waterline, the eyeliner pencil and the eyeshadow. And now to finish the look, you can add, if you like to, a bit of mascara as well as a bit of lipstick. Now this is how you can apply eyeliner for the top and bottom waterline and also how you are making it long lasting. And just by adding a bit of mascara and lipstick you created already a look that you also could wear in your everyday makeup routine and just keep it simple to frame your eyes and a bit of lipstick and that's it. Now I do hope that you enjoyed this little tutorial and if you did so don't forget to give the thumbs up as well as share it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon in the next one. Bye!